In this video I'm going to be editing the large button menu. We're currently on the apps dashboard so click on edit pages and it's on tab 1 so click on edit for tab 1 and as you can see here on the menu on the right we've got header image. We just need to select a new header image click on select, click on upload and I've created a new image here, 640 pixels wide. Click on Open. And it's been highlighted. So we just click on Choose. And there it is in our app. Okay, so now we should click on Save to save our changes. Next, I'm going to edit the button here. I'm going to click on About. I'll scroll down a bit. And we're going to call this Loyalty Card and it already links to tab 1 so we just click on save next I'll change the find us button so it's going to be it's going to be the link to the Facebook page okay at the moment we don't have the Facebook page set up so we we'll just leave it with going to tab 1 even though it's not set up but we'll know what it is later and we'll change this icon. So to change the icon we just click on the image selector. There's no Facebook in the resource gallery. There are a few icons but not a Facebook icon. So let's get one from Google. So we just put in Facebook. Search here's a bunch of Facebook icons I think I'll go with just a plain one if you want to check if it's uh, available for use on a okay so this is wiki Commons, so this is public domain so we'll use this one so click on add to resources and we just click on choose and I did it for the wrong one. Okay, no problem. So I'll go back to Find Us. And it's in our resources now. We'll just click on Choose. There it is there. Now the next tab is going to be Click to Call. So you can put Telephone perhaps. And we'll look for a telephone image. Okay, these are free clip arts. So we'll select Add to Resources. And I'm going to rename it. Phone. Let's call it Large Button Menu Phone. Okay, hit Enter. Now we're going to choose it. Now for the telephone, we're actually going to use Click to Call and the way we'll do that in the layout we can click on this whole button currently it's linking to about us.html so we can change that we can change that to being telephone tel and their phone number which is 09530654584 and we'll save that so now it's a click to call button. Click on apply. Now what you can't do is you can't go back and edit this on this section. So we'll click away. So now we'll click on save. So the next one to edit is button 4 which is going to be our share button. So just type in share and that's going to go to an external page so we won't put anything else there and we want to change that icon I'm going to use a website called share icons and it's quite good for finding icons that are free for commercial use okay I found a share icon 
this is on soft icons and it says commercial usage allowed so we'll use that so file it's a PNG okay we'll go back to the app upload share this open I might rename it large button menu choose okay we've got our share button now for push notifications it's on this section here just say notifications and then the last one is our QR scanner QR scanner okay we'll look for an icon for that as well let's go look at this and look for QR scanner so on soft icons again it's quite good because it shows you which ones are allowed for commercial use this one's allowed for commercial use okay e-commerce and business icons commercial use allowed QR code icon okay let's try that one you don't need it as large as that we'll get a smaller one 128 pixels is more than big enough upload it QR code open rename it it is here we're going to rename it uh, large button menu so that when we have lots of different images we know which ones are which click on enter click on choose there we go there's our icon for our menu it's all our menu buttons done okay we've only linked up one which is this one to tab one all the others and we've also got the telephone click to call touch to call these are all going to other pages which we've yet to put into the app and we'll do that in later videos as you would have noticed there's more than one way to edit the menu buttons we can actually simply click on the button and then click on the pen icon and we can edit the link in this case we want it to go to tab 1 and we can edit the name from here as well and we can select the image it takes us to the app resources where we choose an image which I won't because I've already got an image and then we click on apply and we can do that across all the buttons and then click on save so that is basically the large button menu set up and we'll just come back and edit it a little bit later on click on save and we're done with the large button menu